we are progressing. Now we are going to the SOM sound, which is very similar to this also SOM sound. The SOM sound with a C, Cedil, is SOM, sounds just serves pretty much the same as the SOM. This sound, the sound, is like the shen in English, like a conversation. In this case, we say conversação, conversation, conversação. And this is like the English shen, which is basically the same sound as the former, the sound of, that we have just seen, which is some in words like expression, expression. So, let's see the C, C, D, A with a tilde and O, sound. When we learn, in, in the old days, when school children learned how to pronounce in Brazil, and, and when we came to, uh, to this termination, we had to spell, I mean, spell in words, no? We had to, to say out loud, Cedilha a teu. Cedil a teu. Which in, in English would be something like Cedil a tilt o são. Have I helped you understand or have I helped uh, make things more complicated? Okay, the C cedil. Cedil is this little mark that goes under the C. And the sound is são. And here we have the são sound with an S, which is also shan, in words like excursão, televisão, Televisão, explosão, not explosão, explosão, imersão, immersion, and I repeat the televisão. Okay, the next step is to start trying to read, you know, bigger phrases, and that's it. In the case of the C A tilde O, remember this is this is something very Brazilian now. This 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 conversation, uh, this, this thing like C A tilde O. With this termination, we have words like geração, generation, educação, education, inflação, inflation, informação information. I hope you are enjoying uh, this, this little hints uh, to make you sound more like a Brazilian when you visit our country. We will be back. Ciao.